Hi, I'm Sophie and welcome to my world. Well, spring is here and when I think of spring, I think of sheep. And when I think of sheep, I think of cotton balls. I don't know why, I just do. I think of fluffy white cotton balls. And so I have a little craft project that I think will be awful sweet for you guys. It is a tiny cotton ball sheep. Isn't he the cutest? <laughs> so I'm gonna teach you how to make him right now. For this project, you'll need one cotton ball, two googly eyes, six little black pom-poms, and hot glue. First thing I'm gonna do is take my little cotton and kind of mush it a little bit, give it a nice little shape. And using a work surface, just so I don't get hot glue on my table, I put a little tiny, tiny drop of glue on the first black pom-pom. And I'm just gonna glue it right at the edge. These are gonna be the feet. So I'm gonna glue one pom-pom, basically on four sides. One, two, three, and four. There's three and four. Just be very careful when you are hot gluing these tiny little guys on because they are small. Don't need a lot of glue. I'm gonna flip it over and kind of mush it around to get a nice little sheepy shape. And then I'm gonna glue the ears on the front. One here in the front and another one on the other side. And now the only thing left to do is poof them up a little bit. Get a nice little sheepy shape there. And these are the peel off kind of eyes. If they weren't the peel offs, I would of course hot glue these on. But these have that nice little sticker back. So I'm gonna peel that off, put on one eye, peel off the other. And that's all there is to making a little sheepy. And listen, if you like this little guy, make sure you check the link down below because I have the cutest paper cup lammy covered in all this fuzzy, fuzzy, fuzzy fluff. And he is adorable. And if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. And if you want more videos like this coming to you two times a week, make sure to subscribe. For more fun ideas, check us out, sophie-world.com. You're a goat or you a lamb? There we go, much better.